Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, that's new. Do not press if human. Screw you, robots. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Hello, everybody, Crystal Blaze, and we're here checking out Rick and Morty's virtual reality. It's by the people that made Job Simulator. Which means that everything in here is meant to be screwed up really, really badly. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. Obviously, there's a game behind this, but my job is to attempt to find everything that we can possibly do to break this game and then potentially do it. From what I, I mean, if it's by the same people that did Job Simulator, there has to be a ton of hidden stuff, secrets, and just random things to do. And remember, kids, don't drink bleach. Now, we happen to, is that a urine stain on the couch? Sure is. We happen to have a very inconspicuous options menu over here. What is this? Spectator cam. Broadcast your dumb clone. Hmm, won't be doing that right now. And then what is this over here? Oh, it's the giant Morty mode. This is so that you can be bigger if you're a particularly fetal individual. But I am of normal height, so I think we're gonna be just fine. We have one disc right now, obviously. Is everything else interactable? Like, can you touch almost there? Oh, you sure can. Of course you could. Why wouldn't you be able to? You got all your various volumes here and whatnot. Now, can you move around or is it basically kind of like... What was that? Something just happened. I'm not gonna worry about it. I do notice that all we have at our disposal is a pair of hands and a gigantic floating head comparative to our massive planetary sized melon of a head. Let's, uh, I guess we'll go and start over here. Do Rick's laundry. A simple enough sounding, wow. This is like, this is like the DVD Magnum 5000 edition. Look at how thick this thing is. It got the, it has the appropriate girth, I guess. Let's uh, shove this into our handy dandy disc player and then do our thing. Hey, oh. All, this is Fast Food Fred. Oh my God. And I'm talking today about VR pressing the menu button. Okay. You know, uh, every, every controller has some kind of some kind of button that, that lets you Yep, got it. We we got it. Thank you. No no more. So instead of a burrito, I'm guessing we get hey, the giant alien chunklets. With a tasty chunk. Thank you for pushing that menu button right there. Okay. Have fun out on your adventures and don't forget, we'll always be here with a tasty chunk when you need it. I'm fast food Fred. Out. Fast food Fred. Holy crap, Rick. Teach us how it be. You made a Morty clone, Rick. Yeah, I know. I had to rearrange the entire garage to do it, Morty. Way taller than a normal Morty clone. Pay attention to me. I need you to take this laundry and put it in the washing machine. And if that's too confusing of instructions for you, you know, there's a dry erase board on the uh, put up in the garage here. The dry erase board area. You'll see I wrote instructions on what you're supposed to do. Okay. Thank. All right. Are you, are you just gonna like creepily stare at me while we do this? Probably. I can't so believe we. Clone Rick. Okay, yep, oh, that's enough. I made a Morty clone, Morty. You, what are you going to say about that? Now, can you drink this? Crazy. Yep. Very first thing I like to do is try and drink the super soap he says. No one cares about it, though. That's interesting. How about BAM? Wow, Rick, he's a regular okay. Morty clone. That's right, Morty. Can you eat the Keep fabric softener? Me. Nope. He's, uh, I don't think he's getting it, really. Yeah, you know, all he has to do is put the, uh, Close in the washing machine and then turn it on. You know, it's uh, it take rocket science to figure that out. It's even up on the dry erase board I made. All right, what is on this? This guy got like grape juice all over this, or is it fecal this, material? This, this, this clone, give it a, really a sniff. What it's doing. You know, it's, it's kind of bumbling, bumbling about. <laughs> oh, you know, the eyes! I see, I, I, I see the same thing you you see, Morty. Look, yeah, I'm, just I'm doing it. Just no. shut up, both of you. God, you're both a bunch of scumbags. You're self-depreciating losers there. All right, look. look. You got some of this in there. Pour it in there. Have 35,000 fabric softener. You know what? Take the whole fabric softener. There, there's some more goo in there for you. Close it. Hot. Okay, good. We're done. So now that the good. Clone the laundry, I don't need it anymore. I mean, it's pretty much just a useless pile of floating head and hands. Really? So just go ahead and shoot. Oh, wow. It legitimately follows you! Now serving Morty Clone 2650, sure. Hi, looks like you're dead. Welcome to Purgatory. The devil's not available, so you get me, the devil's secretary. Hey, uh, over here. Morty Whoops, clone. that was fast. Listen, uh, 
had to bring you back for some really important stuff that I can't get into right now because me and Morty have to go. The, 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 some stuff's gotten out of hand. Yeah, you know, we've got to hurry, Rick. Come on. Okay. Listen, I made a teleport system for you. All you have to do is, you know, look in the direction you want to go in the room and then click the trackpad button under your thumb. Just just push the button down and you can teleport to any part of the room. Cool. Thank, thank you. Oh, do I have to do it? Oh, yep, sure do. There you go. I did it. One last thing, Morty Clone. There's a what? watch over there on the shelf. I'm going to need you to grab the watch and put it on your wrist. You'll be able to call me using the watch. This is very important. <clears throat> All right, Morty Clone. Come on, Rick. We got to hurry. All right, Morty Clone. We got to go. Don't touch any of my stuff while we're gone. I'm touching everything, baby. Get up out of here. Old Gray's going to screw this place over big time. All right. What sort of horrifying... Where's that coming from? Oh, it's the watch. Yep, okay. Oh, good, you found the watch. You're not as dumb as I thought. Okay, use that to call me back once you get the lay of the land. Thank you. Notice how he's already drunk and vomiting? Like, it didn't take very long. I'm pretty sure he was normal for a moment here. Oh, portal wall. That's interesting. What other sort of fantastic... It's the uh, creepy uh, Burger King guy's helmet. If you remember, he only was around as a, as a, a specimen of TV for, like six months before I guess they decided he was a little bit too freaky. Can you wear this? Oh, yep. You, you're king of <laughs> world. <laughs> Suck on my wiener. All right, what else do we have over here? Troy. Can you... Can you blow oh, yeah, it out? Uh, ethnic joke. Nope. Welcome to the year 1972, where ethnic comedy... On the ride. Got it. Okay. Have a good one. No more demonetization jokes from you there, buddy. Look at this. We got a goo meister over here. Fantastic. Time travel stuff. Is there a way to open this? Can I mess with this? Is there like a... Is there like, can we peel this back or anything like that? Anything I can do with it? Can you, can you beat it open? I wonder if there's like a knife or anything anywhere. There's some stuff if you grab up higher, too. What do we got down? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh my god. All right. Feel free to put in the comment section if you understand that. So, um, how about this? Can you open? Oh, you sure can. Oh. Oh, I need to grab one and see what it... Whoops. I was gonna say I need to grab one and see what it tastes like. Mmm. Oh. It's like little green brains. But since I'm a clone, it's just fine. I imagine my immune system is top notch. Let me go ahead and slap my fan over here a few times. Can you wear this as well? Can you bust it open? Okay, so you can break pretty much everything in here. I did not know that. Good to know. For science, fan! I have no time for your dilly-dallying. What is this? Is VR just a gimmick? We get the opinions from leading experts in the field of VR. VR equals insta-flop. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this game's hardcore, man. I love it. Oh, oh, it's the Plumbus manual. There's also a picture inside. We'll look at that in a second. Look at that right there. Now you too can learn everything that it takes in order to operate one of these very, very useful items in the world. Although we can't open this. I don't think we can open this. It doesn't appear that you can. There is a little picture over here. I do want to take a young, young Rick. What a, what a glorious, oh, you gotta be able to drink that booze over there. Come on now. GG gasoline. Do not ingest. Yep. There it is. How much of this do you gotta drink? How much of this are you allowed to drink? There it is. That's what we've wanted this whole time. It is straight out of job simulator. It's like the exact same vomit as well. It takes a long time in order to cough it all up though. I'm gonna tell you that. Ooh, a mixtape but from like 1989. That's what I'm talking about. The best mixtape. I'm gonna keep this in arm's reach. We may need that. Blips and chits. Squirt, squeeze, spray and play all day. Oh man. Oh, there it is. There is the plumbus. All right. Hold on now. There's more here. There's a little, little box over here. Like I said, I'm not sure if we can open this or not. There's Rick vomiting very, very articulately on the side. <laughs> Portal wall. We cool? Taking this gasoline with me. There she is. No one knows how to use it correctly. It's just like a giant grotesque broccoli mixed with a poodle with some 
tentacles on the front. What happened to these pills? That they... T oh. I don't think that was supposed to happen. I I just took a pill out of the bottle, but like, not the correct way. I imagine you're supposed to take the top of Earth human. Saint Gloopanoops. So what happens if you down one of these? What do you, what do you get? Oh, I ate half of the pill. There's still half left. It doesn't look like anything. Whoop, never mind. There we go. Let's go ahead and christen this workstation. Haven't done that yet. All right, put that over there. Oh, this must be... Hold on, I think I have an idea. Huh? Oh, I made a metal pill. It's so glorious. Can you eat it? No, it's just metal and sad. Okay. All right. Hold on. There's there's things here. I have ideas. This shirt, because it's amazing. Plus uh, this can of soda. What do you get when you mix this stuff up? Metal shirt. Okay. How about a shirt made of pills? Can you do that? Oh, extra strength shirt suppository. Oh, it's a suppository. If it's a suppository, hold on. Does that mean that you can like legitimately shove it? Nope, you can't do that. You gotta actually eat. Oh, nope, same, same problem. Same issue. Thanks, buddy. And remember, kid, whatever you do, don't drink and drive. So saith Rick. So can you, how much are you allowed to drink of this? Do you vomit if you drink enough of this too, or do we legitimately get like all the schnicket and stuff? Okay, starting to sound like he's getting a little bit too much. Let's keep watering the plants over here. Nope, the kid's fine. Wow, he can really take his liquor. Okay, so what happens if we use this and like a little bit of this? Oh, we made more, but I think we made it with whatever in that per- Whatever is in that, perhaps? How about this? The gasoline. Wait a second. You actually highlight when you- Does that mean that- Hold on. Does your head work? Oh, it does. Can you- <laughs> So what happens if you put your head- Oh! You get a metallic brain! How crazy is that? What the? I did a mixtape in my hand, and I got this. What does that even mean? What is this? It's not even English. It's it's alien. What happens if you put these two together? Do you get an even more powerful mixtape? No, you get the same one. Good times. Okay, how about if we do that? What do you get? You get the same random mixtape. It's like the photocopier, but you get to mix stuff with it from Job Simulator. Kind of like that. Now, can you break all this as well, I wonder? Yep, sure can. What's inside all this? Oh, it doesn't open? Don't give me that crap. How about this? Oh, it's a refrigerator. Oh, we got draft beer. We got mad thirst. Mad thirst. Mad thirst? Oh, it's unlimited. Get out of the way. You too. So what happens if you mix a cucumber and a carrot together? What do you get? What in the hell? What is this? What is this? Hungry cucumbers. Helps build lean muscle. It's got reduced sugar. This sounds so legitimate. Like, I mean, I, I expected something a little crazier, but I guess not. What happens if you mix a food and a drink? Do we get like cucumber thirst? This is like a balloon animal cucumber? What? Is it, is it like glass or? It is. It's a glass cucumber. Okay. What's in here? Oh, mother of God. Nitro dark matter. Oh, it's a tape player area. Hold on. Now we can find out what the hell's on these tapes. Where's the original tape? This is all the weird tape. That's the weird. That's the tape that we made. Oh, here it is. Here it is. The best, the best mix tape. All right. I am the car. I made a mixtape too. Okay. Your mixtape sucks. Mine is better. Right? That's why my tape has no music on it. Oh. Cassette tapes are for pussies. <laughs> End of tape. <laughs> oh my god. Stop. 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 Okay. So what happened when we manipulated the mixtape? What do you get here? You know, I love playing with film reel. It's so useful, it's incredible. You can do so many exciting things with the film reel. 
Okay. They always go biking with the film reel. Because you never really know when you'll need the film reel to defend yourself from all of the schlimflop bears in the forest. Forest. Okay. So this means something. Hold on. For this. So this this film reel means something. Like this has to be important. So if we put this here and we put this here, I can't remember. Do you get Oh, it's blue. Okay, so it's different. These ones are gold, but this one's blue. It's a secret message. I know it is. Hey, uh check out this thing. It's a uh film reel. And uh you know, like they're they're like uh they they have matter, right? And like it has mass and you know when I like to, I like to look at film reel, and uh, you know, I like to see, you know, kind of what they're made of. Sometimes I, you know, maybe I, I pick it up and maybe I throw it. And, you know, uh, I, I, I once juggled with a film reel. Okay, so what happens if you take the blue one and the yellow one? Do you get like a more powerful one? No, it's still blue. Hey, uh, check out this thing. It's a uh, cassette. And, uh, you know, like, they're, they're like, uh, they, they have matter, right? And, like, it has mass, and, you know. Well, I've been playing around. Just close this moment, Jared. What is this? Oh. Oh. Okay. Combinator. Oh, hold on. There's a little sign over here. Broccoli plus can equals metal broccoli. Oh, it's the thing in the, in the, <laughs> the thing in the, in the, the, the prison and the thing underneath the underneath the work. You know what I'm talking about. You guys know what I'm talking about. Can you take this? Oh, you can. I can actually grab this. Okay. The blim blam or whatever. Isn't that what it's called? I can't close this thing. I can't actually get my hand far enough. There we go. I was gonna say I can't get my hand far enough. Can you go down this or is it? Are you allowed to? Can you teleport? No, you can't seem to teleport down into it. So what happens if you make a cassette tape with your head? I'm very curious. Because normally it tells you about- oh crap, I don't know which one's which. Let me try that again. Alright, for science. Hey, you know, I love playing with- Head. It's so useful, it's incredible. You can do so many exciting things- Nope, with head. Yep, I don't even want to know. Oh crap! Okay. I don't know if I was supposed to press that or not. Oh. Oh, I'm miniaturized. Like, I'm substantially miniaturized right now. Crap. Uncharged batteries. Battery charger. Oh, this looks simplistic. How many different levers are there? Do you want these? A little bit of that. Pull on this. There you go. And you're gonna be set. Everything's gonna be just... That's a planet. Oh, crap. Okay. You know, Mortys are famous for one thing. Their reflexes. What's the matter with you, Morty clone? Oh. Okay, one of these. Got it. Alright, what's next? Oh, alright. Yep. Okay. Sure. Yeah, urinate all over that planet. Oh, so hot. There we go. We're gonna get it real filled up. Oh, look, it's got water on it now. Okay, there's a little bit too much water, maybe. Now we're making the lands. Oh, we're playing a little music here, too. It's like twinkle, twinkle. Oh, hold on. Okay, <laughs> get a little. It's fine. Over here. Shut up. This, this, over here. What is it? Oh my god. For the love of all that's holy! Huh! There we go! What a beautiful, what a beautiful little cosmos! Now it can frickin' keep everything powered. Okay. Did that work? Gotta move it real slow. Real slow. There. Oh, it doesn't like that at all. Found a growth hormone? Oh, sure enough did. Hold on. So, if we mix this with a delicious apple, will we get apple-flavored growth hormones? 
Oh, very funny. Okay. All right. So what happens if you mix the growth hormone with these pills over here? With these, yeah, with these pills over here. Let's get rid of you. You get the ultra suppository. Sweet. I gotta know. Does it get even bigger? Oh. It just gets... Oh! <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> okay. All right. Yep. All right. Let's... Can... Does it fit over here? Oh, it does. And it pulsates and jiggles slightly. Not satisfied with the length of your crystal? Use some growth hormone. Look at how much bigger it is. Nice. Do you get a bigger can of gasoline? Now you can do all the vomiting. All right, we're gonna keep this around. Holy crap. Bigger battery? Yep, but it's not charged, but you do get a gigantic battery. Oh, I just turned on the, the washer from here. That was interesting. Into the net. Real fake doors. Seriously. Hey, we're two, two demons and a bee. And you're gonna listen to our super experiment jazz fusion band. Hit it, guys. Zero, one, two. Nope. That's enough of that. Delivery for Rick. We just got a delivery, um, but we can't get it normally. So hold on. I got to teleport over here. I got to get rid of this. That was horrifying. All right, so we got to grab that. But the way we do it, you grab your little buddy over here. You give him the old heave ho. He appearcates. And I think I could probably grab it with him. You just gotta reach way over here, okay? And now with one of these, boom! That's how you do it. What in the holy hell was that? Look great, they don't make them like they used to. Probably a good idea not to order these off of Florg's list. I'm gonna need you to order me another one of these things, Clone Morty. Head over to the, my workbench and um, I'll activate my computer remotely using my remote uh, device. Oh, sweet Jesus. Okay, um. Oh my god, Florp Squad. Oh my god, it's all porn. It's like all intergalactic. Mother of God, I gotta turn away from this. All right, there is a ton of stuff here to mess with. Like this combinator. I feel like there's so many more things that we can throw into combinations and like maybe like weird stuff that we weren't necessarily supposed to see. I really wanna... Now I think the second this sits on the combo thing, it gets all pissed off. Ready? Play it. Yeah, see how it explodes? Now you do get something, but I don't know if it counts. Hey, Let's see. You know, I love playing with nitro dark matter. It does work. So, hold on, if the Nitro Dark Matter works, I just want to see something else, so if we grab it, I only have a second to do this. Oh, it's just crystalline, but it doesn't do anything. So if we mix that with like a broccoli or something, does it make like edible Nitro Dark Matter things? Edible explosives! Now, nah, it's just a metallic cucumber, unfortunate. <laughs> Okay, all right, everything's fine now. Where's that growth hormone at? Oh, growth hormone plus laser gun. Oh, it's just a regular sized gun. I'm not gonna lie, I would. Okay, growth hormone plus explosive, last, last test. We're eventually gonna have to like actually do missions in the game, but for the moment. Oh my God, yes! Oh! For a second, that was pretty cool. Okay, I think we screwed up enough stuff for now. What other things do you think that we can mess with over here in order to- Oh, hold on. 
that's not what I wanted. Where's the where's the real gun? I wanted to shoot some stuff down because there's all kinds of glass and stuff for us to shoot. And I feel bad not destroying it. What other kind of stuff do you think that we should do in this game? What sort of secrets do you want to see? Different combinations of things. I have a feeling that there's all kinds of like hidden stuff that you can do besides making gigantic nitro dark matter bombs. Which is still pretty sweet. Anyway, feel free to let me know in the comments section below. If you want to make the YouTube machine happy, feel free to combine your clicker button and the like button. And there you go. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.